Why aren't you at the appeal for Daniel? Look, I don't have to explain myself to you. You're Daniel's mother. People need to see the pain that you're in. They're more likely to come forward. This is your best chance of getting him back. Look, Simone, I know you like to think you're an expert, but I really don't need your advice. You can't let Louis do this alone. Why do you even care? Because he's the father of my children. And I know how he feels, how you both feel. The fear, the despair, the utter helplessness. But you are not helpless. There are things that you can do, and this appeal is one of them. <laughs> Why? Because it's all my fault. It's all my fault. I'm sure you only took your eye off him for a second. No, this is my punishment. Because I gave Daniel the way. But I never stopped loving him. I never stopped wanting him. I just, I thought that he'd be better off without me. And now he's gone and I don't know where he is or, or what's happening to him. Pull yourself together. I've been where you are and self-pity will not bring your baby back. Fine. You let Daniel down. Is that what you want to hear? You were that little boy's whole life and you abandoned him. Now, you can either keep on letting him down or you can put it right. I can't. Yes, you can. You're strong. You run into burning buildings for a living, for heaven's sake. You can do anything. All you have to do is try. But right now, you are not trying. So get up and fight for your son. <laughs>